Today we are reading Avocado Asks by Momoko Abe. Let's take a look at the blurb. Avocado has a question. Am I a fruit or a vegetable? Luckily, Tomato has a deliciously simple answer. A brilliantly funny book about feeling comfortable in your own skin. Avocado was feeling just fine in the fruit and vegetable aisle of the supermarket. Life was pretty simple. No doubts, no questions, no confusion. Until one day, a small customer pointed and asked, Mum, is an avocado a fruit or a vegetable? Hmm, I'm not sure, sweetie. When we get home, we'll look it up. Suddenly, Avocado's world turned upside down. Fruit? Vegetable? Avocado didn't know the answer either. So Avocado asked the vegetables, Am I a vegetable? The vegetables seemed muddled at first, but then the cabbages said, You're not leafy like us. And you're not crunchy like us. The carrots cut in. And vegetables don't have a big stone in the middle like you do grumbled the potatoes. So, you're not a vegetable. Okay, I must be a fruit then, thought Avocado. So Avocado asked the fruits, am I a fruit? You're not sweet and juicy like us, said the pears. No one would eat you as a dessert, giggled the bananas. You belong in a salad, but not a fruit salad, chuckled the peaches. You're not a fruit. Avocado's insides felt like they were turning to guacamole. I don't belong with the vegetables or the fruit. There must be somewhere I can feel at home. But where? I'm pretty sure I'm not a herb or a sausage. I know I'm not a tinned pea or a bean. Avocado came to the fish counter with their fins and scales. The fish looked very different, but it was worth a try. Am I a fish? Don't be silly. Avocados can't swim, said the fish coldly. You're not a fish. But what about the cheeses? Some of them were round like avocado. Some of them had hard skin on the outside too. Am I a cheese? asked avocado. You're not. A cheese. They smelt a lot like feet, thought Avocado. I'm rather glad I'm not a cheese. Maybe I'm an egg. Nope. Avocado was more confused than ever. I'm not a fruit, a vegetable, a fish, a cheese or an egg. So what am I? Far from the fruit and vegetable section, Avocado was feeling lost and lonely. And that was when Avocado heard. Hey, cheer up, amigo, said Tomato. You don't know what you are, so what? Don't stew in your own juices. I'm a fruit, but no one believes me, and I don't care. Because I'm tasty, hot or cold, I make splendid salads and superb soup. People love me on pizza and adore me with pasta. And they can't get enough of my ketchup. And you, avocado, you're the star of any salad. You're terrific on toast and tremendous in tacos. You're scrumptious in sushi. And your guacamole is so delicious that the other fruit and vegetables go green with envy. Who cares what we are when we're simply amazing, said Tomato. It was true. They could just be themselves, and that was enough. Suddenly, Avocado didn't feel lost and lonely anymore, and that was when they heard, <coughs> Excuse me, what are we? Fruit or not? Am I a weed? Am I a spice? Fruit or vegetable? Fruit or veg? Spoon or fork? The end. You've been listening to Avocado Asks by Momoko Abe.